Well, as Jason's been telling us, Hurricane Michael rapidly mm -hmm. powering up and could be a Cat 3 storm by the time it makes landfall somewhere along the panhandle. But it's not the first time the area has been threatened by a major storm in October. Meteorologist Matt Barentine explains. Hurricane Michael is forecast to become a major hurricane and make landfall in the panhandle. If this sounds familiar in October, well, we've been here before with Hurricane Opal back in 1995, a major hurricane. This one started in a similar area on the U just off the Yucatan, went across the Yucatan and more off to the west, and then it traveled across the Gulf, picking up intensity, becoming a major hurricane, and then making landfall with winds of 115 miles per hour on October 4th in Pensacola. It had a storm surge of 15 feet, and it did massive damage. Hurricane Opal was one of the most destructive storms in modern history. A peak wind gust of 145 miles per hour was recorded at Hurlburt Field as it made landfall. Okaloosa Island and Fort Walton Beach were devastated by storm surge. Opal caused $4.7 billion in damage, making the third costliest storm at that point. Opal also led to the deaths of 63 people, leading to the retirement of the name Opal. Hopefully Michael doesn't live up to this October monster. In Mobile, Matt Barentine, Fox 10 News.